Okay, so just went over the deck profile. We'll just go right into the matches. Okay. Oh, uh, okay, I expanded. You guys see, I actually made some climbing on this ladder. Probably take me a while to find this, so go get your snacks. Oh, no, never mind. Uh, right here. Okay, let's get right into it. Uh, once again, we're playing Rayquaza, the deck that just recently won St. Louis Regionals. This is not his list, just so you know. I'm just putting that out there. This is not his list. Looking at a dark, normal internet. I don't know what that deck could be without tails. Of course, it's heads. Um, should be interesting. We have a pretty good start here. We should get start off with Ray, because we have Link in hand and stuff. Oh, so yeah, we're just gonna start off with Ray. We're not gonna bench the Toad because we don't know what he's playing. Um, the grass guy kind of throws me off. He might be playing. Okay. He had a Blastoise coin, so I was just thinking if he was playing Blastoise, but I don't know what the dark Pokemon would be. So he floats it onto the Gobi. I just see a Sycamore. Nothing. I wonder what the dark Pokemon is. He just had a Red Raid. Is there another Combi? This is a. Okay. Evital, Fright Night. And will he. The big question is if he retreats in the Fright Night this turn. Yeah, that's a big question. He's gonna get artillery. It's kind of risky. But we can top deck a hex. We're in an excellent position. And he doesn't decide to retreat. Interesting move on his part. So we're gonna go in the Mega Ray. Get down Skyfield. And we're just gonna throw away our two guys. Um, the Limpwood could be also a cool card in this deck. I always say the Limpwood's a cool card in every deck. Just because we could go delinquent him right now if we had Jirachi. Jirachi opens up so much things. Um, do I want to bench this Toad? I think I do. He can easily pick off Shamans the same way he can easily pick off Toads. So I'm going to go with that. I'm going to get it. Those three. Seems about right. And we're going to be all set up for six. And the big question is, can we get a turn one attack with a Hex? If we can get that, that'd probably be, like, one of the most insane turns I've ever had with Ray. So, draw six cards. Okay. This is interesting. So we'll compressor away hex energy. Get rid of okay. So, right now, we go for an ultra ball and right here. I'm just gonna grab a ray for now. I'm just gonna shaman see if we can a DC mega turbo. Any chance, DC mega turbo? And regular energy. Should I just go for one card? I don't think it's worth it. Oh, so I'm gonna via seeker just chorus here. Yeah, I'm just gonna chorus here for like a gazillion cards. You see, Mega Turbo. Oh, uh, for some reason we can't. Get a single DCE. We're gonna link this ray. Attached to the active. Floatstone Caldeo. Yeah, if I got rid of another energy, we could go double, just double Mega Turbo active. Um. Actually, I'm just. I would just evolve the other ray and just go in, but I'm gonna go. Well, what am I. Yeah, no, that, that wasn't good. Should I play that? Um, yeah, I don't know what I was looking for. There, there it is. Um, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm just gonna grab another Via Seeker, because there's a lot of stuff you can do right now. 
and he's just gonna scoop. He's just gonna scoop out. So we're gonna catch another game. He's like, we're not staying here anymore for this deck. It's too strong. And this is, I think this is a glitch. 270, 225. Long way apart. I'm already up there. So, yep. So we'll get him to one more game. Playing against a pure psychic deck. Uh, this might not be the best set of games to catch. We'll see. Well, let's us go first. Interesting. Sir Ray. Uh, maybe you could hex him turn one. Or her. Uh, we got Hoopa here. Got Mayo off the top. Okay, let's Hoopa. Really looking for just Skyfield here. Kill okay, you. That. That. Okay. Chandelier. Should be an easy matchup. Ray, can we pull, can we get a sky Wow, uh, it's, it's one of the best, one of the best trainers males I've ever seen. Okay, I think we just failed this. Shaman, setting up for four, looking for Skyfield Ultra Ball. Come on, turn it off. It's okay for now. Skyfield! Can we? Can we? Two cards? Nope. Uh, I think I just go via secret end here because I'm gonna find a place. I'm just gonna end. I could have Ultra Balled for Ray and just ended my turn like that, but I think we could get a more explosive turn. That was good. Yeah, that was good. And we'll just... Uh, I'm just gonna go in a group and protect the ray. But yeah, okay, that's a good turn one. Can attack on turn one, so I consider that a good turn one. If we can top like Skyfield. Okay, yeah. It's probably not a competitive deck. Hopefully can't deck... Okay, yeah, you just scoop... Okay. Uh, two scoopers on turn one. So, yeah. This deck just makes you want to scoop. So, we're gonna go one more game. Let's go. Can we get a match where they don't scoop? Can we do that? Playing against Metal Psychic. This could just be Trevenant with Jirachi and No Shaman. Pretty weird, but, yeah, this could be it. This could be it. Okay. So, if he gets turn one Trev, we're pretty much dead. Even more dead! We start Jirachi! Yay! Okay. See what he's actually getting it into. Okay, he's playing some type of metal deck, which is good. So we're not gonna get turn one item locked, and we got some mulligans. If our opponent gets this us, we're pretty much dead. Um, but yeah, we're just gonna hope our opponent does not play gets us. Here's a different card. Stick. Long time to choose here. Okay, I'm gonna bench this toad. So Galio. Okay. Oh yeah, that's probably why I should have expected so Galio. Ball. 
just passes. And topic Skyfield. That's a huge top deck. So now we're able to Ultra Bowl. Getting a re. Uh, Hoopa. And it's starting to get set up. Yeah. This is looking really nice now. Okay. So you get Hoopa. We'll get. One, one, Hoopa. No, no, no. Hoopa! Hoopa. Scoundrel in the ring. Drunks. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Keldeo, Ray, and Shaman. Looks nice. We could toad lock him this turn, but I'm just gonna go for the turn one knockout. Yeah, we could turn uh, toad lock him that this turn. That's definitely an option. I'm looking for compressor link float still. Hit one link. Can raid. I'm just gonna go sycamore here. Uh, I will have to get rid of some resources. Have float. Yeah, but nothing that great. Maybe tone locking him was a better option. Um, but I didn't. Okay, I'm fine. See, parallels. Well, I'm just gonna get rid of those two then. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna leave this rushing active. See what he does. It's gonna evolve into bronze for it. Or bronze zone. Let's get ever soda. Bench. It's gonna chorus for seven. A lot of Pokemon coming down here, which makes this chorus really good value. It's gonna retreat into another Cosmog. You're just gonna metal links. Okay, I might just lie center of that Cosmog then. Yeah, I'm just gonna lie center of that Cosmog. It's gonna go rush in. Well, you could just go Rare Candy, Soul Galeo. KO. I'm gonna guess this. Get a VS Eagle. That's really nice. That's actually really nice. So now he's basically stuck, and I could just emerald break him, like, until he loses, unless he top decks him again. So next turn, okay, he's gonna promote this, feeling confident. Now, he clinked. He's just gonna attack and retreat again? Nope, gonna leave it active. Um, I'm gonna try to start getting another race in it. So, I'm just gonna chorus here. For like a gazillion cards. Oh, that was nice. I already just scoops. So, yeah, guys. Three guys scooped to me. And pretty much that shows you the pure power of this deck. This deck is so good it's so strong but yeah uh thank you guys for watching and i'll try to keep on doing these daily videos each day but um definitely you have the chance try at rayquaza it's a great deck in the expanded format i think it's really good but other than that thank you guys for watching and i'll see you next